Well, hey there, it's Stevio, and we are back in Iowa. Yeah, don't hate, because I just couldn't pass it up. I know, I know, this is a little redonkulous. A purchase like this only comes around once in a while. I just had to, even though it's probably one of the most uh, cumbersome tractors to drive. I mean, look at that. What do I have, like 20 foot of hood in front of me? I got two smoke stacks, and they sound like they are blaring right now, don't they? So, I was gonna try to use our vertical disc here, and it's still a little too frozen out there, so I had to uh, back out. I can't even fit this long thing in my shed. Ugh. I mean, that thing is cool. I've been dying to uh, try this thing, so I just had to go out early, but it's a little bit too cold still. Oh well, we got plenty of time. Both of them screaming turbos there. So I've been busy. I've been busy picking up a lot of things. I actually got this new skid steer. So it's a stand-up skid steer made by Vermeer. A 450 Vermeer. So I need to unload this thing. Hoping... Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't think that was OSHA approved. I wouldn't recommend that to anyone. I think this will work great getting in them little spots. Actually, when I purchased this thing, somebody gave me a little heads up. We have been seriously thinking about expanding our cattle herds. I'm actually thinking about purchasing a dairy. There is one down in the county that is for sale uh too bad uh farm boy isn't around i heard that he he's at some uh van convention or show showing off his new van i i i, exact, I don't know exactly what but uh, i think i'm gonna facetime him for some of it just because this is a pretty serious thing and we can't let this pass up so now we gotta figure out what are we gonna drive there so we got the gmc van we got the Mustang, we got the Tacoma. You know what? When you're purchasing something, the most important thing to do is not to show off money. Yep, the rabbit. It's coming. What? This has uh, power windows and doors. It has plenty. All you need here. Don't make fun of me. Don't make fun. It even got a rear hitch on the back. When you honk this horn, it actually sounds like something that should be in a little Volkswagen. Yep. So when you are purchasing something, you gotta make it look like you don't have no money whatsoever. So maybe you get a little of a pity deal. Well, I doubt Grant can even hear me, but uh, we gotta give him a little honky honk. It will be kind of a long drive, so one of us might end up having to uh, move out here. Especially dairy farms, you gotta feed twice a day, every day. You gotta milk the cattle. You gotta uh, get the feed ready. You got to be, you know, constantly be watching out for the cows and everything. So it is a pretty demanding business. And it would be kind of hard on us driving, you know, what, 15 miles one way every day. I'm pretty sure this is this is the area, right? Otherwise, I might get run off by a shotgun. Yeah, this should be the area or the dairy. They are taking visitors to come around. I guess everything you see here is going to be on the auction. Oh, we got a motorcycle here. Yep, wouldn't mind having that. And wow, this. An SVT Mustang here. Wow, that would be a nice addition to the farm. I love this style of Mustangs. Oh, listen. Nothing sounds better than a Mustang V8. Whew. Man, that sounds so good. Now, this is a very unique power stroke. 
This should really make Farm Boy happy if we end up getting this. Wow, somebody definitely tricked out. Very tricked out on the inside. I don't know if I like the seeds. That's too much for me. Okay, this looks like their feed truck. So they got a Peterbilt feed truck, which is good because I uh, don't think we'll have to upgrade this anytime soon. What do they have here? Ooh, this is a very unique feeder. Yeah, you just sit here, turn this thing on, feed the cattle. Feeds out right there like so. Very good for feeding in uh, tight areas or in barns and stuff like that. Very nice. It's kind of different, but I guess it'd be a good backup. Huh. We got a, f a grinder mixer on a Ford Turbo, a 7630 Ford. Kind of like in the Ford here. Looks like they might be using it to grind a little corn. Very clean inside. Starts up right away. Good little chore tractor. Man. Got all the controls all jammed up right there. What do we have here? We got a 2950 on a loader tractor. Graffle bucket here. Nice little chore tractor. Very nice. I don't know about an open station on a manure spreader. It might be a little bit big of a manure spreader for this tractor. I'm not sure what exactly horsepower this would be. It is a front wheel cyst. Not a bad looking tractor. Ooh, looks like we have a silage bagger here. I'm pretty sure this what this is. Or maybe a uh, corn silage. Yeah, that would be nice. Definitely need that. I didn't see no silos around here, just one bin. Uh, Honda four-wheeler here. Yeah, that would be nice. Checking on the cattle and everything. Let's see what we got in this beautiful looking shop. Oh, I love how these things look. Oh man. Man, that would be nice. Sassy Massy Harvester. Yeah. It, it would be kind of weird sitting over to the side like this. Yeah, that is definitely far over to the side. It's kind of like the old 8820s and all that stuff. I don't know, maybe you sit a little bit further to the side, maybe I'm wrong, but you sit on the side of the engine, so the engine's right beside you here. The feeder auger and everything runs to the side, so as long as you could see down one row, so this has a six row corn head on it, so I guess you could see down to the side here. Would be kind of challenging uh, turning around from side to side and uh, counting rows. Except if you're turning to the left, it'd be easy. But wow, look at this uh, John Deere diesel wind roller here. Twin knife. Whoa, we got a 4960 here on what is this? An eight row max merge uh, corn planter. Yeah, that would be nice. Whew, beautiful tractor. Man, I'm hoping I'm not seeing too many options around here that's going to take it out of our price range. I got to tell you, this International, man, is this a beautiful looking tractor. It's got a loader on it. It's got a graffle hook. It's a four wheel, front wheel sis. You just don't see them every day. Starts right up. Chromed out pipe and everything. Wow, look at the fenders. There's going to be multiple collectors looking at this thing. I guarantee it. Looks like we got a little uh, cultivator here. Eight row. Yep, eight row on a 4840. Man, I'm seeing all these nice tractors and everything. I'm getting a little nervous. Might be out of our price range here. Well, hopefully not. So... Oh man, look at this thing. Oh my goodness, a 4320 with a year round cab on, on another little eight row cultivator. Oh, uh, 
front wheel assist. You just don't find them every day. A little uh, straight truck here, grain truck, trike interrogator here, sprayer. Oh man, that looks like it's in pretty good to condition too. Guess uh, there won't be no way you're not going to be able to check out on, on the cattle. You definitely can get to them somehow. So many nice items in this shed here. Pretty sure... Yeah, there should be another shed around the back here. What? That's on tracks. You just don't see that every day. I guess you can pick up bales anytime you want. Wonder if the hay comes with the, the purchase. What the heck? What is this thing? What? I've never... That is so wide. That is the weirdest hood. An 8650. Well, we got mufflers on both Is that too... Wow, look how hot that thing got, that muffler. Unless they treated that. Wow. Okay. Alright, so we... One is up front, and one's a little bit further back. That's a little different. Alright. One muff. Oh, I guess because if it was back, it would be right here in the cab door. Alright. Huh. So. I don't. This gotta be some. This gotta be a farm mod out there. This can't be real. Looks like it's on a five shank ripper here. On, and then we got a case payloader here. This would be nice. Definitely for picking up turds in the, for the dairy or filling up the feed wagon. We got a new ideal. Big old uh, manure spreader here too. Wow, look how clean this thing is. I'm going to open up that other shed door. I'm going to start this thing up. I just have to hear how these two engines. This is a side by side. My other one's a what would that be? A front and rear. I don't know what the what to name that other one. Man, I'm gonna have to name both of these tractors something unique. But thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time over here in Iowa. If you think I should buy this dairy, leave it down in the comments. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and share and subscribe. Wow, that sure sounds unique. If you want to play with all these mods and more, check out Apex Game PCs. They make a PC that'll run all this stuff. Use code SQUAD, save 10%. Later, y'all. Make sure, like the video.